Hey guys, welcome back to City Skylines. And first off, I wanted to get started by saying um, it would be amazing if you guys could like. Um, if you, you know, enjoy the video, it's 100% free. You can do it. It's hell. I mean, you could dislike if you want. Um, and then, uh, yeah, make sure to, um, subscribe if you really like the video and you'd like to see more of this series, see more of me messing around with new Tampa and stuff like that. Yeah. Alright, so let's get into it. Um, so basically what I wanted to do is I wanted to um, make a kind of a nicer like suburb area over here. Like delete some of this right here and make like a nice suburb near the... I might need to move these. So we got that and then I'm sucking up my water right there, that's, that's fine. Um, yeah, so, I mean, we have more than enough, and I think we've unlocked, we've unlocked all of these, right? That's why I had trams. Don't I? I mean, I guess if I don't, I can just use above ground metro okay because you know if you guys don't know about florida is um we can't have underground metro because you know we'd be swimming in water if we did all right so what i basically want to do is i want to expand this road out into this area oh lovely all right so expand that out over here. Oh lord. It's trying to make all the bus stops right there. Alright. We'll fix that later. I think it's one no, it's one way the right way. Alright. That going into there. That one going there. Yeah. Alright, I think that's good. So we wanted that. I have like just small little roads going like this. Make make sure it's not very dense. And then I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put some paths in here. I'm so surprised I don't have trams. Is that a different DLC that I don't have? I guess it is. It must be. That's fine. I can, I might just put a um, a um, above ground metro somewhere along here. All right. So now we got that. Now where's the paths? Park paths. It's in one of these, correct? Right? Ah, uh, yes. Sure that's not gonna look that great. <laughs> Alright. Now I gotta place some trees down so I can wait. Let me let me get some good housing in here.
All right, so basically what I've got done so far is I made a monorail because I couldn't figure out how to do the other thing. Um, it just was not working. Even the above ground like rail wasn't working because it it weirdly wasn't like allowing me to like use move it. So yeah. And so now I have this. It's not all the way done. I'm gonna exp I'm gonna expand it. I'm gonna expand it down this road right here. Um, I think I'm gonna cut across first and put a stop like right here outside the side of the college. Um, yeah, I think I'll do that. But it won't be a part of this line. This line will cut across and go down there. Um, yeah, so I'll talk to you guys in a minute when I get that done. Alright guys, now I've finished the red line, and it's... Here, let's follow this one, as it goes along the red line. Oh! Alright, now I've finished the red line, and let's watch this train go along its merry way. So now it's in the station. And here it'll go along these gentle, gentle curves. Now this step right here is a little bit of a roller coaster, but once you get in here, it's like smooth sailing all the way to the next, um, the next station. And the next station is in the middle of the road, and it's actually kind of a nice station. I like how I got it to be placed. And then it comes up through here into the industrial area where it travels over the road like this and then comes off into the final station so from here actually from this central station we're going to make a new line that'll specifically go to the college and then later on down here so we're going to start that off by placing a where is it by placing a monorail station here or maybe I need to bring a road to it here is there a small road I can just do this small industrial road yes there we go now here comes the curve And then straight line like this. I don't like that, but all right. All right, so now we have a new, new line starting here, and then we can destroy that one. Um, just put some off-campus housing, like or on-campus, off-campus housing, or whatever. Just put some like right there. It's like the president of the school's house. Yeah, that's what we'll go with. Oh, we can have like little shops here for the school. Like little paths walk up to it. Oh, sorry. Because you know, like areas around school, there's like there's dense, there's dense and sometimes not dense housing. And there's there's like shops and stuff nearby. And also, if you've ever been to, like, UCF, there's, like, it's, like, full-on office buildings, like, just around the corner. I think I'm going to add this in. Perfect, perfect, perfect. All right. So now we can make the line. All right, we're going to create a new line. And we're only going to run it to here from our, for right now. Then we're going to create it. Line overview. Wrong thing where is it ah here we're gonna make this the blue line so this is gonna be the red line red rail blue rail all right so we got that line set up and what i need to do real quick is geez 
<laughs> garbage is literally just not getting processed. So I need to help facilitate that. And then we need to build another neighborhood. All right, now I'm making our second major neighborhood. Um, I'm expecting more of a um, richer clientele up here. Uh, I'm gonna actually raise the taxes up here as well. Now I'm gonna implement a second bus line over here. Bus, bus line. Man, I hemorrhaged quite a bit of money when I was making these. That first line can be a um, from an orange line. Second one can be more of a blue line. So I was thinking at these stops, we can have little pedestrian paths that kind of lead into the other areas. Now I'm going to set these up as two separate neighborhoods. So here's a neighborhood number one. All right. So I've just decided, oh shit, water level lowered, I guess a little bit. All right, whatever. Um, I, um, I put in a new garden. Um, not really, it's not all the way down yet, but I was just going to see like, what's up. I actually wanted to talk to you guys for a little bit. Um, I was wondering, um, like, how are you guys doing, stuff like that. Um, cause, I don't know, like, be kind of a dick move if I didn't ask, I don't know. Um, basically, um, I wanted to talk about, like, what I've done so far since, um, yeah, um, what I've read recently, I don't know, um, I, cur I just finished the book, well, I finished The Martian several days ago, and that was a great book, and then today, I finished, a um, the first, um, the first, uh, comic for East to West, like, I finished the first volume, and that was, like, spectacular, it's, like, so cool, it's a really, like, cool take on the apocalypse and things like that um i don't know i just really love it it's great um yeah so let's just watch some of our uh, our houses get built real quick yeah we got water we got our trains going i'm very pleased Oh, we're waiting for our houses to actually build. Let's see how many. Yeah, 142. <laughs> One passenger from the blue rail. That'll go up. That'll go up. How many tourists are taking it? Why would a tourist be... Alright. I never really meant for tourists to be on that one. But alright, let's see our new, new people moving into this area. Quite nice. Quite nice. What I want to put in this area is like, I want to get the high-tech housing thing. Oh yeah, I never made this another neighborhood. All right, um, yeah, so that was the Heather District. And I kind of want to rename these later on. I'm going to have this one included in this one. Um, I want to rename these later on um, with things that you guys suggest. So yeah, if you have any, tell me. Um, 
Yeah. So if you have anything, tell me. Look at that, there's high tech housing. So these houses will be like better than normal because this is going to be like the rich part of town. Oh look, there's a U-Haul truck right up in the front. You load. I am actually going to delete all of our previous bus lines because <laughs> they're in sore condition right now. Quite sore. So just give me a second to do that. Well, I'll keep the ones that are very important, but... Looks like there's not much going on. Yeah, I'll keep these two for the time being, because those are school routes, I believe. So not only we're spending less money on those two lines right there, there isn't much going on. Um, and this is all part of our um, attempting to, uh, you know, alleviate traffic and also just make our city look nicer which I'm gonna transform this area right here in just a minute. Alright, so I've been experimenting with this. I want to get the- oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. I want to get people to like walk on the beach. So what I'm doing is I'm going to do this. Like have like beach paths so i i made a new area it's actually quite nice and i gave it a um i gave it like this long bike path kind of reminiscent of saint petersburg's like bike path on their um barrier island which is kind of annoying that we don't have barrier islands like you'd think that whoever made this map would you know implement them but nope it's okay we're doing this also, I expanded our college. Look at this. It's looking amazing. Um, and I edited this a little bit. I found out that I can just put it in the middle of the road because this will be kind of a more high traffic area. Um, another good thing is actually, I think our traffic is doing somewhat better. Well, at least on this side of town, it's doing better. Um, but down here, not so much. But, that is fine. Everything is doing okay. Alright. So, yeah. Right now we have um, a whole new neighborhood. 
And yeah, it is going quite swell. Oh yeah, and so today I had to do this like, this course on like sexual assault for my college or whatever. And it kept just constantly saying to like my utmost annoying, uh, like, <laughs> It kept saying that sexual assault is only able to be caused by men. Like, it wouldn't even, like, even get close to the fact that women can do it too. And it kind of annoyed me. Not not that I'm saying that, like, men don't, se like, there aren't men who sexually assault. Like, there are, and it's a problem. But, like, come on. It's not, it's not all us, bro. It's not all us. And... Fucking Massachusetts, bro. It's... Yeah. It just annoyed me, because, like, it, it does happen. Girls do it, too. But you, as long as it... As long as it, like... As long as it fits their narrative, it, they're not gonna cover it. It pisses me off. That's one thing that pisses me off. As long as it doesn't fit someone's narrative, it isn't mentioned. And that's something that's wrong with both sides. And it just bothers me so much. Alright. On the other hand, look at this bike path! Whoa! Look at him go! Look at him go! Our red line has saved 77% of car trips. That's insane. That is absolutely insane. And quite impressive. It's mostly taken by adults, of course, and young adults. All right, that sounds good to me. I think I'm gonna expand this beach area to have maybe just a bus system. <sighs> Quite annoyed that I don't have trams. I swore I had trams. Highland Gardens, Heather District, Cypress District. I think, I think I'm gonna have these renamed just like, like famous Florida shit. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. Um, just give me one moment. You're gonna, you're gonna see a whole change right here. Alright, so I named the things that are going to be permanent, um, after famous Florida things. Like, we got Flo Rida College, we got Natty Light Beach, we got Orange Park, we got Gator Hood, and we got Tarzan Cove. If you, if you don't know, the original Tarzan movie was shot, actually, in my hometown, so now you know where I'm from. Oh, yeah. Um, well, technically my hometown. Not really, but kind of. Technically, it counts. All right. I think this is going to do it for us today. I'm sorry. Not sorry. But it's going to do it. It's going to do it for us today. Just look on the wondrous monorail that we have built. This episode might be a short one, might be a long one. I'm not exactly sure. But... I do know that it was one. <laughs> Alright. I'll see you guys next time, I guess. Bye.